Right before I drive away to forget Why do I give a damn at everything we say no? G'day guys, Chaos Chronicles. Alright, so I thought today we'd do a video on something that I don't think many blokes will admit to and um, it's a real, real thing in prison and um, alright, so let, let's just ha use a bit of context here. So, as you know, I, I've explained this before that there isn't many things that you cannot get in prison. And um, as a matter of fact, the only thing that you cannot get in prison if you are a male is a female. And the only thing you can't get if you are a female in prison is a male. Now, I know a lot of people will debate on this because people will say, oh, yeah, people have sex with screws and this and that. Yeah, they do. But for the vast majority of... Um, these um, prisoners, they do not get to have the luxury of having a, um, you know, their their um, sexual preference. Now, once again, people are going to say, all right, what about the people that are gay? Do you know what I mean? Well, then I guess them people do get to have their sex sexual preference. Do you know what I mean? But, you know, for the vast majority, they do not get to have a sexual partner. And, um, you know, and people, um, people then um, tend to, people get very creative in prison. Let's just say that some of the smartest people I've ever met in my life has been in prison and you know some of the things that i see while i am in prison is absolutely beyond me and um yeah just blows my mind how smart people are and when they put their mind to it they actually get get these things done what, what they want to get done and uh yeah so um you know i, I will also say this that um um the very short time that I spent at Loddon Prison, I will say that I was lucky enough to be, they wait for everyone to come off the bus to see who's there. But anyway, everyone was waiting for their mates to come out who just got on the bus and the screw came out and the, all the screws were laughing. And um, yeah, sure enough, someone had actually tried to bring one of those electronic um male pleasuring devices that you see on social media and um yeah it was actually one of those motorized um um partners i will say and and like the screws were going oh yuck and it was like in a bag and it was pretty funny um but you know that's the only time i've ever heard of that happening too but um yeah for the vast majority, they do not get to have a sexual partner, you know, and like I was saying, people tend to, um, you know, resort to making funny, funny things. And um, yeah, so one of the funniest things I've ever, ever seen, um, and, and I'm going to put my hand up and say I did try using one of these things myself, and um, it's called a Fifi. And um some of you may have heard of a Fifi, some of you may not have heard of a Fifi. Well, let me tell you what a Fifi is. So a Fifi is, it can be one of many things, but what it is, is it's basically when you make a male pleasuring device um, and people make it in so many different ways. Um, but, but, but most of them make it with a towel and... Um, and a glove like so um y there is never a short supply of those blue rubber gloves or those clear rubber gloves in prison um they are absolutely everywhere and especially like my, even more so now with covid like it's very easy to get a glove you just walk up to the screws and say can i have some glove i've got to clean myself and they will give you gloves you know 
people use them gloves you chop off the fingers of them gloves they are little balloons and people store things in them little glove fingers and they use about five of them and then they put them up in their um their backside bank and um they use five because um your stomach will eat things um very quickly and this is why people um die in prison um because of overdoses and stuff like that because they only have things in one balloon and then you know they have a bulking amount in their stomach and it bursts and they die anyway that is another story so um luckily i i have a fifi i made a fifi for you guys but i'm going to run you through how, to, how it's made so basically the people will tell you many different ways um but the best way is to, to get a towel and then fold the ends in on either end and then fold it in again on itself and make the towel about that long right and you will see in the end why i say make it that long right and then so what you do is you then put the glove on uh the end and then you have the fingers facing in. So, you know, the wrist part of the glove is facing out. So then you roll it up so it makes a nice little um, cylinder. And then you fold the glove over it. But um, you guys are lucky because I do have one here to show you. So, um, yeah, this is for educational purposes only. Um, and, yeah, I'll, this is all I will say on it. So this is this is a um, this is a fifi, and um, so that is uh, how it's made, and and as you can imagine, what what is done there, and then um, yeah, you can even get proper lube in prison. You can even get condoms in prison, which is pretty funny, and um, yeah, people do use these. And you can get adventurous. You can get adventurous and uh, put one on the other end. So then you've got need I say any more but anyway guys that that is a fifi and you know I don't know if there are many people or many blokes that will admit to um using a fifi I will put my hand up and say I have tried a fifi and um um what I mean out of 10 it's definitely you know it's definitely one of those ones that you wouldn't tell your mate about if it was real that's for sure um and um yeah it's um it's it's probably not the best in the world but look it it there are plenty plenty hundreds of probably probably millions of people all around the world that uh, make do with a fifi and um plenty of pre plenty of them do but probably won't admit it but i will um and i even admitted getting advent um adventurous and look at that have a bit of a laugh again um backside and front side if you will uh well there you go guys that is uh the the tale of the fifi and there you go like i said not many dudes will admit to uh to uh partaking in fifi activity but i will put my hand up and say i have and um yeah for all those people watching out there um yeah don't don't do crime and um and you won't go to jail and have to um, degrade yourself to um, to having Fifi partners. Crime shit. It doesn't pay, guys. Trust me. You're only going to end up in prison. If you do crime every day and you are not ending up in prison and you're getting caught, you are a snitch. I've said this before. All right, guys. I've been the Chaos Chronicles. I am yeah. also the guy who decides if you and your friends walk out of here or not.